Princeling ain't easy. Son of Dictator gives up $30 million. You can have my $30 million, but you'll never get my MJ memorabilia. That's what you could say if you were Teodoro Nguema Obiang Mangue, Vice President of Equatorial Guinea and son of the country's ruthless dictator, Teodoro Nguema Obiang Basogo. What's up? What's up, YouTube? What's up, people of the internet? I am back again with another video. Another one, another one, another one, and another one. So, if you are coming here for the first time, remember to subscribe to my channel. My channel gives you life and you really need it. So, on this one, we are talking about the most corrupt people in Africa. And I am going to be talking about one person today. Teodoro Nguama Obiang Magwe. I know so many of you will be asking, who is this guy? Who is this guy? Who is this guy? Oh, you don't know the guy? The guy is actually the vice president of Equatoria Guinea. But to my surprise, you actually know his father is the president. Sometimes I just wonder what is wrong with Africa. Ah, what is wrong with Africa? Africa has never actually been a very bad place from the beginning. Africa has never actually been so bad like it is before. We had times of Mansa Musa and so many great people, but now they turn Africa to a rotten place and a bad place and a rotten place. So let's really talk about who this man is. This guy was born on the 25th of June, 1969. So you know he's old enough not to even live under his father. He's supposed to be doing different business and being on his own, but you know he's a prodigal son, so he will always be under his father. Okay, let's talk about what he has done. This guy is having problem in France. Currently having problem in France, not in Equatorial Guinea, not in West Africa, not in any place in Africa, not in Nigeria. The guy is currently having problem in France. What did this guy do? They said he embezzled hundred million dollars. In case you don't know, Equatorial Guinea based on GDP and slashing their money based on per capita is the richest country in Africa. Oh my God, these people are a bunch of criminals and rogues. This guy has a lot of crime under his belt. This guy has a black belt in criminology. This guy actually suspended his prison sentence for three years and was fined $35 million. These guys are criminal. They are criminal. If you check his Instagram, so many things he posts on his Instagram like it is big assets. He is spending the money of the country. These people are very corrupt. And today we have busted him. They are one of the most corrupt people in Africa. Make sure to subscribe to this channel to listen to so many, so many, so many stories of the most corrupt people in Africa. And we can talk about them down below. You can also submit people's you can also submit names you want us to talk about here on this channel you can see he is so so corrupt so so corrupt plenty properties plenty things and we can also talk about so many of them anybody anybody you want we talk about it so like share and subscribe here on my channel okay bye bye Woo.